Monsanto is facing an antitrust inquiry from the Justice Department and also one from the state attorney generals. They both stem from the fact that the most important biotech gene ever developed, the Roundup Ready resistance trait, it's called, is going off patent. And that's never happened before in this industry because it's a very young industry. And there's no law telling people exactly how to transition seamlessly from a patent monopoly into a generic competition situation. In this case, more than 80% of all soybeans, more than 92% of, of genetically modified soybeans have Monsanto's traits in them. More than 70% of all the field corn in the country, more than 80% of all the cotton has a, a Monsanto trait in it. The concern is that as new traits are being developed, and there are a great many new traits coming down the pipeline, if farmers want to get the benefits of those while keeping the benefits of Roundup Ready, they have to be bred into the same seed. And this gives Monsanto potentially a sort of gatekeeper power. There are two concerns. One is that Monsanto may be uh, taking actions that uh, will prevent its Roundup Ready product from becoming a generic as, as a practical matter. Because they've developed a second product called Roundup Ready 2, which is patented and will, where the patent will continue to 2020, and they would prefer that people switch over to, to that product. They say it's superior. The question is whether they're using any sort of inappropriate means to persuade seed developers and others not to use Roundup Ready 1 anymore.